It's Saturday the 13th of May. It's day three of the Irish Amateur at the Island Golf Club. Bit of fog this morning, delayed the start to play, but they got underway at 10.45, which means the leader should be teeing off at around 4.30 this afternoon. And they hope to get day three finished today and then day four, just 18 holes tomorrow after the cut tonight. So if you're doing nothing better this evening, come out and watch some great golf. It's, it, there's some really, really good scores, good players, playing for a lot at stake, Walker Cup places at stake. So it should be great golf over the next two days. So Keith, I'm getting great reports from all the players and from Golf Ireland saying that the course is magnificent, <clears throat> in great condition. So how has the week been for you and the guys in the shed? Yeah, no, the feedback's been great, John. Um... Obviously, Golf Ireland were out last month and they obviously gave us a quota that they wanted to hit greens between 9.5 and, and 10, which we're, all greens are mostly at 10 on the stimp, so we're pretty happy where the greens are at. Um, every morning's been a full setup and full cut, um, so the presentation standards are obviously have risen with that as well. Um, and we had a lot of moisture there Monday and Wednesday and Thursday, so I would have preferred coming into this week being a bit more drier, but look at it, you can't control Mother Nature, unfortunately. But no, look, we're happy where the course is at. Um, as I said, the feedback's been great, and look, it's a good challenge of golf out there. Um, golf Ireland have probably been very fair, I would say, with the setup of the golf course. A lot of white tees, but obviously, look, you still have to shoot uh, good scores out there. Um, yes, the fog was there today, unfortunately. Um, hopefully, it doesn't hamper our setup tomorrow, and the guys can get finished today and get the golf fi- finished. So it'll make life a lot easier for us greenkeepers tomorrow. Um, and uh, no, look, it looks like it's going to be a nice day. The fog is clearing up, and you can see. It. It's gonna, I think it's gonna, the sun's going to come out as well, so it's going to be nice. One, one of the things, Keith, I'm hearing a lot is, and it's it, well from a lot of the members who come out and are watching the golf, and from the players, is the definition. That the definition seems to be a real highlight for people. How, how have you achieved that? Yeah, no, obviously, look, the, the natural rough has jumped a little bit in the last couple of weeks as well, with the temperatures uh, uh, soaring a little bit as well at night time. So that's had a lot of definitions of the course. But obviously, John, just the frequency of cuttings increased with this week. So the presentation, obviously, you can see looking down the 14 fairway there, you can see the definition between the aprons, the fairway, and the semi-rough, you know. So it's the frequency of cut, and obviously for a week that's in it, you, you have to, you know, get the course to tournament standard. And then I see every evening then the guys are in. So they're, they're working long, long hours this week to get it into this condition. Yeah, I think the guys be looking forward now to when Sunday's over. So, uh, no, look, it is a tiresome week, but it's the sort of week that you you look forward to it as well like it's it's not often these events come around and um it's great for ourselves and the members to showcase our golf course to the the rest of the lads in the country and also there's a lot of international players here this week as well yeah no, it is great like there's a lot of golf are doing a great job on the social media i don't know if people are following it but i think if you on twitter I, i'm seeing it anyway if you just look for golf ireland there's a lot of player interviews and the compliments from the course and from what they're saying it was really really fantastic to hear so Monday then, I think the members have a competition. How will the course be set up on Monday for them? Well, it's copy and paste of Sunday, John. So um, the golf course will remain the same. We'll put the blue markers out for the, the members on, on Monday morning. So they'll play um, Sunday's event on Monday. So wish us all the best of luck with that. <laughs> well, if you're not on a timesheet already, get in quick. Monday, BRS is open. If you want to play on Monday, play the same course that the guys are playing tomorrow. It's going to be in great condition. Um, look forward to seeing you all over the weekend, hopefully, and seeing the, watching the golf, and then on Monday to play. So from myself and Keith, over and out. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.